Welcome back to Jeebus Gaming guys and we're here at the first GameStop dumpster. If you're new to the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button and leave this video a nice like. Looks like there's only one GameStop bag in this dumpster. Let's get right into it. I hate these weekly ads. They always make the bags feel heavier. What are these? That's pretty cool. I've seen these on another YouTuber's video before. They're actually Call of Duty World War II beta flyers and since the beta is over I guess they threw them out but I'm going to keep them because I'm a Call of Duty fanatic. What is that? Looks like more of the same thing. Oh, that's kind of cool. It's in the plastic so I'm going to take it. Why is there so much construction paper? What do they have like confetti party in GameStop? Uh, looks like a bunch of trash. What was that? Just a water bottle. What are these? <gasps> yes, I've been wanting to find these so much. Call of Duty World War II pins. I've been seeing so many in other people's videos and I haven't found any yet. And I've been so jealous. So happy I got me some now. Red box? What? That's weird. Never found a red box before. I'll tell you that much. A Visa gift card. That's really weird. I'm gonna take those and check them. Never seen those before. GameStop gift cards never have nothing on them, but never seen a Visa in a, like that. 99% sure they have nothing on them, but I'm gonna check it anyway. And looks like that's it. Besides some dead batteries. All right, still cool. Let me make sure this isn't GameStop right here. Can't quite see it. No. Let's look at the other side. Doesn't look like nothing. Let me go around just to be sure. I see a couple cases. Up, oh, never mind. Look at this. Almost didn't check here. Let's look through some of these cases and see if they're games inside. Just a case. And just a case. That's still perfectly fine. If you guys didn't know, I'm actually making a case wall right now. So these cases are freaking great for me because I will be adding them to the wall. If you didn't see that, check out my last dumpster diving video I'll show you at the end of the video you can go to the end and look at it it's pretty freaking cool ah these things always get me battlefield 3 another one cool those cases with extra pieces in them are great for storing stuff another case world at war one of my favorite call of duties case let's see NBA case ultimate alliance spider-man case I don't need all these bags. Get out. Let's check this one. Modern Warfare 3. Check them. Check them. Oh, that's all of them. I'll put all this stuff here. And I will see you guys at the next trash can. Welcome back to Jeebus Gaming, guys. We just got all this awesome stuff home that we found dumpster diving at GameStop. And tonight was an amazing night. First, I want to get into these posters. We have about 20 of these, and unfortunately, I had to go to the bathroom really bad, so I went in the store and actually let my fiance and brother go look in that GameStop dumpster, and of course, we find these freaking amazing posters that I don't catch it on camera. These things are absolutely huge, and on one side, it's Call of Duty World War II, Join the Infantry, and on the other side, it's actually a massive Destiny 2 poster, so that is freaking awesome. I'm going to be using the Call of Duty side. I don't know what I'm going to be doing with the rest of them yet. If you think I should maybe give a couple of these away, let me know in the comments below because I think they're awesome. And this picture on the camera does not do it justice. These posters are way bigger than normal posters. They are absolutely awesome. Alright, I did find another pack of these. Believe it or not, I probably have close to 100 of these. But again, these are selling great online so I'm not going to complain. If I keep finding this, it's pretty much like finding free money. Found a simple CD case. I just took this because I have a lot of loose discs. Nothing too impressive, but it will help keep some of the discs from getting scratched up. These, I was really happy to find. I've seen a lot of other GameStop dumpster divers find these, and I had yet to find any. So I was really happy to find them. There are a bunch of different buttons all about the Call of Duty World War II beta. I love that beta, and I love this game. So I'm really happy to find these. They're awesome, and it's a whole plastic bag full of them. I'm guessing about, what would you say, 15, 10 maybe? Of these buttons so I was really happy to find these 
Next, I actually found this. It's really, really cool what it is. Actually, it's a Call of Duty World War II, but it actually had like a calendar, like one of those old school calendars you see in movies where you rip the day off at a time, and it was counting down to the beta. Even though the beta is over now, I still think it's pretty cool to have and keep, because like I said before, I'm a Call of Duty fanatic, so I actually really love this kind of stuff to keep for myself. We found a bunch of Xbox 360 cases, which are absolutely great right now even though there's no games in them if you didn't know I'm actually working in a spare bedroom I have and I'm covering the entire bedroom all four walls in game cases so finding cases now is absolutely great for me because I'm gonna be using them to cover those walls and I'll give you guys a quick update at the end of the video on how that's looking but if you didn't know look at my video before this and you can see the progress we made last time we found a ton of Xbox 360 cases way more than this and I already have all of those on the wall and they absolutely look great already. Sounds like my cat's having a sneeze attack over there. And we found a couple blank cases. I keep these because sometimes I find the cover art in the dumpster without the case. So I keep the blank case in the case I find the cover art. And I can have another completed case I can add to the wall. These are actually just Call of Duty World War II beta flyers. They're in the plastic so I kept them. They're basically not much. They're probably just something GameStop laid on the desk to give out to people. But to me, again, anything Call of Duty related, I usually take because I love it. Just a couple more Xbox 360 cases here. No games in these. Another one. Someone actually wrote on that one, but if you didn't know, Sharpie will come right off if you actually spray deodorant on it. Spray deodorant on Sharpie and it'll wipe right off. Usually I don't take gift cards, but I thought it was kind of weird to find an Amazon and a Visa gift card in a GameStop dumpster. So I took them and check them. Um, there's probably a 99% chance there's going to be nothing on them, but I just thought it was really weird to find Amazon and Visa gift cards in a GameStop dumpster. So I took them anyway just to be sure. PlayStation 3 case I found with all the Xbox 360s. There was just the one. Lastly, some type of Wii. I'm not sure. Wii stand. A Wii U stand, it looks like, and an adapter. I don't know what plug goes in there. Hmm. Maybe it's a charger of some sort. Again, I don't really keep up to date on Nintendo, so if you guys know what this is, please let me know in the comments below, because I really do want to know about some of the stuff I have. I'm not even sure what it is. Out of everything, my favorite thing has to be these freaking amazing posters. I'm so psyched. I really cannot wait to put a couple of these up on the wall. And again, if you guys think I should get some of these away, let me know in the comments below because I know there's other people who love Call of Duty just as much as I do that would really appreciate this. Now let me give you guys an update on how my game room is starting to look with all these dumpster dive finds. Welcome back guys. So this is the wall right now. It's starting to look really good. We're filling it up a lot quicker than I thought I would. Over here we're going to have these next gen cases and PlayStation 3. I forgot they were the same size. So I'm going to fill this all the way to the floor. Over here, we're going to have the regular size cases again, mostly 360, but also Nintendo Wii. If I ever find PlayStation 2, original Xbox, any of the regular size cases, I'm going to fill this wall up all the way to the ground down here. And as you can see, this is some of the stuff we find the first night dumpster diving. This is all of those Redskin Star Wars things. As you can see, we have a ton of them. Right here is just the gaming accessories I'm keeping. Some controllers, a hard drive, some Wii condoms, some wires, a phone case, stuff like that. And over here is just pretty much everything else that's gaming relating and just kind of random. So I just put it in there because I don't want to get rid of it. It's stuff that I want to keep myself in the blank cases in case I find slip covers or art to put on the wall. Right there, this stack of games are all actual games. So that's amazing. Right here is where the DS's are going to go. And as you see, the Destiny thing I found actually fits perfectly into the window. So that looks absolutely amazing. Anyway, thank you guys so much for checking out the video. If you're not already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We do awesome dumpster diving videos all the time. Give this video a big fat thumbs up. And until next time, peace out.